This remarkable women's story is brought to you by the Low Law Firm. Well, now continuing our remarkable women series here on KTAB, we're highlighting the stories of women in the big country who are actually all going above and beyond in Some a big way. Some amazing <laughs> stories we've heard already, and this week our Jessica Rank takes us to Callahan County to meet a woman who has worn many hats over the years. Today, Melba Miller sits behind a desk at the Callahan County Sheriff's Office. Uh, this has to do with payroll. This has to do with vehicle maintenance. From the looks of it, she's got everything down to, to a do schedule. But it's not because she's been here her whole life. In fact, this isn't even her second or third job she's held. I've never really had a job I didn't like. Melba went to school at McMurray University with the intention of becoming a basketball coach. I just enjoy working with people. But after talking with her professor, things changed. She said, Melba, that's not right for you. Melba went from the court to the classroom. That's the best part of teaching is being able to guide young minds. She started as a cougar over at Cooper High School, once again behind a desk. I was a secretary at the counselors at Cooper. After a year, she got a job as a teacher, helping students realize their full potential. You can watch their faces and see when they say, I got this. You can also watch their faces when they say, you're speaking a different language to what I speak. After nearly 14 years in front of the class, Melba took an assistant principal position at the school. And after another 13, led a program to help students struggling to keep up. You could boost them up by saying, oh, we can do this together. You'd be surprised what they would accomplish. Melba spent 39 years in one school district at one school. When I went to Austin to get my retirement set up, he said, well, let's look at your schools first. I said, we'll just look at one school. He said, nobody stays in one school district the whole time. I said, well, I did. Melba started at the sheriff's office eight years ago with Terry Joy. Her next journey still unknown. I lived one day at a time. But either way, she'll be ready for it. In Callahan County, with coverage you can count on, Jessica Rank, KTAB News. Thank you, Jessica, and congratulations to Melba, one of our four finalists for our Remarkable Women contest. The winner receives a prize package, and that announcement will be next Thursday. April 1st. Pretty impressive. Great story. Pretty steep uh, competition there, too. Yes, <laughs> yes. Ms. Miller, great job.